Hello and welcome back to another episode of Wildflowers. Uh, let's get our game loaded up here. Hope you're all doing well. Oh, that's right. We just had the wedding. Um, I ended the last episode kind of in the middle of the day. I guess we could get changed back into our normal attire uh, now that the wedding is over. Because uh, we're going to be going back, I believe, tonight to, yes, take the winter ritual incantation to the high priestess. We're going to switch the seasons from autumn to winter. That'll be really fun. Let me uh, remember how to do things here. I want to get some more outfits for her. Oh, I forgot to put her bracelet on for the wedding. That's all right. That's all right. Um, I think we've kind of talked to people. It's been a few days since I recorded the last episode. Yeah, we're, we're all talked out right now. Um, I think I, well, you know what? Let's go do a little foraging. I can't make the run speed incantation because we're missing one of the flowers we need and Shelby isn't selling it. I think it's a um, spring and summer flower, so we're a little out of luck on that. I'll go see, though. We'll go double check. Hey, Amira has a quest for us. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Enjoying the woods? I like to walk along the shore of the lake. Sometimes I get lucky. Oh, sounds like you have more fun here than I do. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just meant that there are some native plants here with good natural anti-inflammatory properties. So why are you in the woods today? Um, actually, I was going to visit Shelby. Let's say we're looking for wildflowers, I've though. I've been looking for some wildflowers, but I think I've already found the most beautiful one. Oh, flirty, flirty. Oh you are a charmer, aren't you? Well... I want to be available to my patients whenever they need me, but sometimes I just need a quiet place to reflect. And for I some reason, that. a lot of people here seem to be wary of these woods. So it's a good place to go for some space. Would you keep my secret spot to yourself? I have certain patients who will track me down every time they have a cough. What secret spot? <laughs> my dog just coughed in the Thanks. other room. That's hilarious. I can tell you're an easy person to trust. That was good timing. As soon as she said, whenever they have a cough, my dog coughed. Y'all right there, Bubby? Okay. My dogs have been very hyper, by the way. They are nine and ten years old, and for some reason they have been acting like puppies lately. It's kind of adorable. Hey, Shelby, do you sell things that are out of season? No. Well, I mean, you don't have the one I want. Bummer. All right. Guess we're just walking slowly. We'll we'll still do the summon small things incantation. I mean, we don't have to suffer with both. Not 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 active words. Oh gosh, words are already hard for me. Oh, <laughs> gotcha. A char. Do I have anything to sell? Oh, we got a piece of wedding cake. We've got blueberry tart. I believe that was a gift, too. I don't remember who from. All right. I'm going to go ahead and use the summon small things incantation. Things I want, but don't yet have. Get off the ground and in my bag. Yeah, there's not much I can do about not having enough of the other flowers. Or the running of the fast. <laughs> That's all right. We'll, we'll be fine. We have our broom if we need. We've got lots of levitation potions. Got one. I do like running around and uh, talking to everybody, too. So, Hi, Princey. Oh, I have Prince coming in to join me. You gonna lie down? I could turn on the doggo cam. I don't usually have that on when I'm uh, recording this. I usually save that for live streams. Hi, bub. Go lie down, hun. Hey, Bruno. Okay, yeah. I'm turning on the dog cam so you can see what my doggo has just done. I don't have the light on. It's going to be a little darker, but I don't want to disturb them with the light. But yeah, that's how Prince has decided he wants to lie on the couch. He makes it a bunk bed. We've got Duchess down below and Prince Rupier up above on the cushions. Lovely. Here. Let me get a little closer. 
I don't think that's going to block anything important on the screen. You might miss some dialogue. But since they speak it... Yeah, we've already talked to everybody after the wedding. Oh, there we go. Let's just do a little more fishing over here until it's time to change seasons. Uh, then we'll get some more flour, make some more of those delicious fish sticks that we like to sell. Aw, oh, baby doggies. Yeah, they've been really cute lately. Oh, yeah. Very playful. But they save it for our teeny tiny living room, <laughs> which gets a little out of control. I don't know what it is with them. You can't get them to play outside. They just want to run and jump all over the sofa. And us. <laughs> but we played a little fetch last night. It was great. It was so nice to see Bubba being so spry. Oh, wow. He's gotten so gray, too, the last couple years. You're doing a good job, Tara, getting lots of fish. Oh, oh we yeah. need to top off our magic bar, too. Oh, let's say hi. Did, oh, we talked to her at the wedding, too. I just, I worry about her with the, everything that went on with the ac accusation about her mother being a witch, and she was already kind of down, and just, life's just been really rough with the loss of her dad, and then that. So I want to talk to her more often. Oh, you know what? Well, it's almost time anyway. We need to make sure... I think some of our flowers are ready, too, for harvesting. So let's go check on that. I think the others need a little water. I'll be right there. I just love how colorful, you know, like this area is a little bit dark and gloomy, but the pops of color, so pretty. And here we go. Collect. So we got more an an anemone flowers. I always have trouble saying that word. See an enemy. <laughs> the an enemy fly. I can't do it. It's one of those words. All right, when are these going to be ready? Two days on the molly flowers. I can't wait to see what kind of crops we can plant. Next season. And I wish you guys could hear just how peaceful my doggos are. They're breathing and little snores. It's my favorite sound in the world. Have you prepared the winter ritual incantation? I have. I'm ready. I have it, and I'm ready to change the seasons. Good. Then let us begin. Witches of the Fairhaven Coven, take your places around the circle. Once again, we turn the wheel of the year. From which is new and which is old, we greet the coming of the cold. We call forth the spirits of quiet and reflection. We call on the candle's flame, surrounded by darkness. We say goodbye to the bounty of the fall harvests. And welcome winter. <sighs> it's snowing. Oh. I love snow. <laughs> a good sign it is, too. Means the island is in harmony with itself. I'd say I agree with you, Farseer, but, uh... Belladonna's knickers, it's coming down hard now. Quick, everyone get home. I don't want to treat anything for Frostbite tomorrow. Uh, all right, task complete. We get uh, the revitalizing potions. Very nice. I want to make sure there aren't any other quests here. Okay, let's 
Hop off. A little more. There we go. All filled in. Uh, let's fly on home. That music got loud. Oof. Um. I just want to pat pat the kitty. Maybe we'll oh, give you that catfish. Ooh, crickets and a chub. I wonder if she'd like a pup fish. I haven't found her other favorite. I remember Fungus told me and I didn't jot it down. One of these days I'll remember to just have the little wiki open while I'm sitting here playing. <laughs> you still liked that, didn't you, kitty? Then I can just look up everybody's favorite thing. I think my whirly gig did its job. I might have to recharge it. We'll definitely need to recharge that one in the morning once we plant some seeds. Although I also don't mind watering. Oh, we've got some cider ready. Okay, 24 hours on our silk thread. All right. Did we have anything going on down here? Oh yeah, I had a whole bunch of levitation potions crafting. We're gonna need wheat so we can make whiskey because I think that's a good gift maybe Should for I Wesley. So we'll do that. Oh. Who do we think this is? You all probably know because you've been playing it. <gasps> uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, this isn't good. Raven. Who's Raven? <clears throat> Kim? Hi, Tara. Mrs. Soft has given me the, uh, honor of organizing the Winter Feast this year. See, every household contributes something, and we all gather together for a feast on the shortest day of winter. What a nice tradition. Sophia used to run things, but, well... Right. So, I'm making a roast with a shiitake mushroom sauce. I hear shiitake grow in the mine, mm -hmm. but... I don't do small enclosed spaces. Not at all. Uh, don't worry, I am on it. Thanks. Wait, do I have to bring something to the Winter Feast too? You're a household in Fairhaven, aren't you? <laughs> Hazel used to make roasted salmon every year. What if you tried that? Okay. Challenge accepted. I'm looking forward to sharing some salmon-y goodness with the whole town. Oh, if only everyone else in town had that enthusiasm. I hope Kai even remembers to bring something this year. Okay, the Winter Feast is coming up in 10 more days. We did just learn the recipe. Okay, we've got that. So we need to make a roast salmon. Let's see what all we need for that besides salmon. Find any shiitake yet? Yes, ah, uh, here they are. Oh, you're my hero. Seriously, there's just something about dark caves where like anything could be in there with you. Like right. bats or wolves. I hadn't actually thought about that, but I will now. So, thank you. <laughs> oh, always good to keep a lookout. All right. Oh, we got some pork as a reward. Oh, let's say hi. I was happy to take the winter feast off of Sophia's plate. Oh, no pun intended. I don't know what Natalia and the rest of them thought would happen. 
You can't just single someone out like that. All right. Roast should be in the oven then, right? Here we go. So we need, we have the fennel, we need a salmon. We've caught salmon before. Spinach, so hopefully that's a new recipe we get. Um, do I have any of the speed grow stuff? No, let's go make some, maybe speed grow and other things. I forget what all we need for them. Miracle Grow. Just to make sure we can uh, do our thing in time. I'm I'm determined to not fail again. Uh, let me get our little whirly gig going, and then we'll uh, check our mail. Feedy. Ten days. Hey, Feedy! Yeah. Get to it! <laughs> Thank you, Feedy. <clears throat> Greetings, neighbor. Every year, we have our traditional secret holiday gift exchange. The names have been drawn, and your recipient this year is... Give a... Jo jo oh, Joshi? Yoshi? Yoshi? I forget how she says her name. That's for Giva. Bring her a gift anytime before the winter feast, and be on the lookout. You have a secret gift or two. All right. I'm opening up the interwebs, people. We need to see what we have to give Giva. Gonna lose audio for just a little bit. I'm sorry. Wildflowers Giva. <laughs> 1-800-flowers.com post popped up first. Okay, what is she like? I don't want to read all of that stuff. I don't want to read all of that stuff. I just want to know what she likes. Oh, favorite gifts. Here we go. Uh, chai, prawns. Wait, I don't know if I can make chai. Let's write that down. I don't think, well, prawns. Kola wada. I, I can't pronounce things. I know. Chicken tiki. We might have that recipe. Chicken tikka masala. A Bombay burger I don't have. The other thing I don't think I have yet. All right. Okay. Sorry about that. But okay, so bring her a gift anytime before the feast. And that's in 10 mm. days. How am I supposed to know what kind of present Giva I just use like? the wiki, Tara. You have a special gift as part of the secret holiday exchange. Got it. Let's look at our beverages. Maybe that's our best bet. We'll see. I also do catch quite a few prawns, though. Oh, yes, we do know how to make those. What do though? I want to make sure that's the thing I just wrote down. Wow, I write really special. We have everything except for the shrimp. So we can make that for her. If we were to do the drink, do we know how to make chai? No. Okay, so we'll do the prawns. Let's go to the store, get some seeds. Kind of circling around the long way. I don't know why I was looking for weeds and stuff. I see some I missed over there. I just remembered I always like going this way to get any little harvestables. I love the um, little flowers in the grass. I think that's new for the season. Let's see what we have around here. All things we use. Uh, store first. We'll worry about prawns later. Gotta get our crops in. Let's say hi to Parker, though. 
I hope he and Lena work out their problems. Angus said the portrait was his favorite wedding present. Thanks again for making it possible. My pleasure. Nice. I hope you guys don't mind the doggos are blocking a little bit of the text, but since there's voice acting, if you, and I think I have it loud enough, it should be fine. Can we remind him to bring something? How's it going, Kai? So good. I just got a package from my mom. Every year when it starts getting really cold, she sends me a bunch of eucalyptus leaves from the tree outside her window. Oh. Mm, it's the best smell. That is a good smell. Mm. Oh, you know what? I did want some, I don't know what mushroom leather's for. I think I wanted a piece of leather, though, for... Um... An outfit. I try to make an effort to check in with Sophia every day since we work just across from each other. But I can see the question in her eyes. Why didn't you defend me, Lena? Uh, I wish I could make her understand. That's so heartbreaking. So fennel, onion, spinach, and sweet potatoes. Let's we know we need spinach. Let's buy these first. Well, we'll just buy a bunch. We have extra or whatever. That's fine. That way we can... Because how long How long do they take to grow? Six days. Okay, so I'm going to put the speed boost on those. Five days on the onions. I don't remember how many plots I have. <laughs> Maybe I should be buying more. I also need flowers. And I also need regular flour for some fishies to cook and sell. Oh, you can buy grapes, but I'm, I'm, I'm good on not doing wine. We could buy the spinach. Let's buy a couple. Just to be safe. Oh, let's say hello. I always worry about what to wear for the winter feast. I want to look classy, but it's hard not to puff up like a marshmallow under all those layers. <laughs> what you're wearing now seems fine. That's true. This outfit does have a certain charm to it. Hey, Damon. I always make an extra special drink for winter feast. I'm going to get started as soon as the ingredients come in the mail. Sounds fancy. Can I taste test it? Sorry, but it's best as a surprise. Aw, I'm always down to taste test some drinks. How's it going, Julia? The winter feast was my favorite part of this season. Now even that's ruined. Aw, I'm sorry. Hi, Bruno. Kim says you're trying out Hazel's roasted salmon recipe. I'm not sure my version will measure up. Ah, don't get your shirt tails in a twist. No one can make it quite like Hazel. I tried it myself, but the way she cooked it, that fish had a real spicy kick. Okay, um, let's go up to... I think Violet is open today. Let's see what, um... She sells as far as flower seeds. Maybe check out some dresses. Or a new outfit. We do have an outfit we can make soon. You know how I some think. people get more depressed when the sun's not out as much? Mm -hmm. I'm like that. Oh, how many flower... I Why did I not count my things <laughs> before I came over here? That's fine. Pretty sure I've bought extra. Um, I'm not gonna sell any of those. I, I'm gonna hold on to them. Oh, look at this cute little basil and denim overalls. That would be kind of cute for wearing during the winter. Oh, it's so hard not to buy them all. Kind of like, wait, what's this one? 
Oh, Midnight Lace Jacket Dress. That looks very fancy. I don't know if I like that one a whole lot. I love that one, but that feels more spring to me. We do have that white dress we haven't made yet. All right, let's get stuff planted. Oh, check the quest board. Who's that for? Holy shiitake. We can do that real fast. Is the clinic open today? I just ran by it, but I don't remember. I don't think it was. Oh, it is. I love how we just carry our whole inventory with us. We don't have to worry about storage or anything. You brought the ingredients I asked for. They're just what I needed. I wouldn't want anyone to stay sick when I can help. I don't see things like this very often, but it's good you moved here, Bamira. Oh, that's so nice. Saw Juliet when I went to Lena's yesterday. She said Kim's really been helping out. I'm sorry we got off on the wrong foot. Their heart's in the right place. Yeah. All right. Time to get to planting. Oh, I do want to say hi to the guys. Oh, we got a cutscene. Uh oh. Oh. Hey there, Tara. Uh, don't mind me. I'm just bumming a bit today. Aww. My baby brother was supposed to visit, but he got slammed with work and couldn't come. It's probably for the best. Why would you say that? I know how close you guys are. Yeah, but it doesn't feel really safe here. Otto says people wearing cloaks are going into the woods at night. I don't know what they're up to, but it can't be anything good. Cloaks are just quite warm. The town's quirky. We shouldn't judge them. I, what's good? We shouldn't judge. Whomever the people in the woods are, they might not mean any harm. We shouldn't rush to judge them any more than you would want to be judged for your beliefs. I guess that's a fair point, but you have no idea how dangerous witches can be, Tara. It's not all superstition. They hurt people. Thing no, is, no. I've always felt really protective of Jamie. So long as he's safe, that's all that matters to me. You're safe too, Angus. This is a safe place. It's kind of you to reassure me, but I think we all have to be on the lookout. You can't be... Oh, we're best friends now. You can't be accusing witches, all witches, of being bad people. There's good people, there's bad people. There's going to be witches with good intents and maybe some with less good intents. You just That's just human nature. It's not just because they're witches. We got lots of useful wedding gifts. Natalia made us a new cast iron pot. But don't tell her that my favorite gift is that portrait Parker gave us. Oh, nice. We should see how Natalia's doing. I'm sure she's not feeling very happy. I also probably could get some ingots made. I heard Sophia isn't organizing the winter feast this year. It's all my fault, I suppose. If anyone should have to skip the feast, it should be me. Hmm. Oh, not really. And we're about to be broke. <laughs> Gotta save up for these. We don't even have enough gold yet. I need 3,000. Gotta do a lot of fishing and a lot of mining. I keep saying I'm going to do it on my downtime in between episodes. The mining and the fishing, and then I get so caught up with other things. All right. Let's get you charged up. I know I don't have a lot of gems. Let's see, that's three days. We'll do five days. Hey, planty. Water some plants for me today? Yeah, first I have to get them planted. <laughs> so, two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven, twelve. <laughs> How many different types of crops do I have? One, two, three, four. So I can do three of each of these, and then we'll do the flowers in the other bed. I don't know why with the controller, I always highlight the wrong spot. Okay, we'll do our fennel.
I love our little helpful whir whir whirly, whir whirly gig. I can't say words today, you guys. And we'll just do four then of the onions. Why not? What a good little helper we have. We do have to go give some love to our animals as well. We have a cow and a little baby sheep. Let's see how grown they are now. Get our flowers planted first though. appreciate that he's watering even though we don't have flowers in there um i'm gonna alternate we'll go crocus i don't know why i just like the look of alternating primrose that'll be pretty the purple and pink alternating crocus Busy, whoop, busy first day. Oh, Mayor Otto, what do you have to say for yourself? Otto, uh, about Sophia's trial. Yes, it was a bit of unpleasant business, but necessary. We must demonstrate that we are serious about protecting our town. Now other troublemakers will think twice before causing trouble. <sighs> You're a troublemaker. Okay, Primrose. So Crocus. Nice, this will get our beehives going again. And we've got extra seeds for planting. We need to go, um, see what's available for harvest in all the different areas too. Oh, are you going to bed? I just want to give you some love. We need to see how much feed uh, Feedy has or whatever that name is. Oh, we need to get another chicken too. We only have the two right now. Cause, you know, I'm sorry. I'm going to be selling them. We need the, the uh, product they produce. We're a little broke for that right now. Can I pet you while you're in here sleeping? <gasps> look how sweet they look while they're sleeping. Oh, oh well, we could give you a little treat. I still haven't found out your favorite. Can I wake you up to give you an apple? I know you like apples. And of course I remember I have forgotten what I've already given the sheep as gifts. Probably an apple. I know the ear of corn. Not sure what else we did. We'll we'll find it. We'll figure it out. Yeah, let's see how much you have in stock. Okay, you have a little bit of feed left. All right. Oh, well, we're getting milk now. We've got eggs and we're getting wool. Turned into cloth on a loom. Nice. 
We have time to go into our workshop. So we've got everything planted, right? I didn't miss a spot. Very good. I like that there aren't, there's like not an overwhelming amount of crops to get planted. Like I love Sunhaven and I'm having so much fun playing it. But boy, there's a lot. So I haven't unlocked those recipes yet for wool. Why can I not do wool? So what do we need? This is our formal dress we could wear to the winter party. Oh, we can make it. Oh, you could sell these too back to Violet. I should see what they sell for. I'm not going to. So we need, oh, green cloth, blue cloth, black leather. Oi. Oh, that's what we use the wolf for. Never mind. Why was I confused or thinking other things? I don't know. So I could put some speed grow on the plants we just planted, but I almost don't feel the need. What do we need for kimchi? Soybeans. I don't think we've grown soybeans yet. Oh, does Thomas... I need to check in with Thomas. He, does he occasionally have some seeds? It's late. We're going to go to bed and we'll check in with Thomas in the morning to see if he has any seeds. Also, let's see. I think I just need a sit. I do, I think, just only need the salmon. I hope. Yeah. Uh, yes. Yeah, so now I just need the salmon. And then the shrimp dish. I forget where we make that. There we go. Frying pan just cooking. I just need the shrimp. So tomorrow we need to get a shrimp and a salmon. Should so we'll have our... Oops, yes, go to bed. Our winter feast quest quests done. I gotta stop slacking on those and having things timed out. Too many games and too many quests to keep track of. Two days remaining on that. Hey, Thomas, I was just going to come see you. Morning, Thomas. Morning. Got something for you. Happy holidays. Five sunflowers. <sighs> oh, Thomas, this is so nice of you. Wait, sunflowers? Where did you get these this time of year? A friend built a greenhouse and <gasps> a said greenhouse? this. Barker could build you one, too. You Heck just yeah. need a glassworks in your tool shed first. Lena can sell you any off-season seeds you need. She gets some from time to time. Off-season crops fetch a higher price, too. That's a great idea. I'll get started on it. Love it. Oh, ooh. 18 glass. Glass is a useful... So we can use a kiln for that for, with sand. I don't think we have a kiln yet. Ingots... And wood we have. We just need more iron. Nice. Are you looking forward to the winter feast, Thomas? Uh, Sophia usually runs it. I'm only going this year so Kim has a decent showing for their first year in charge. But I'm not making anything fancy. <laughs> okay. Greenhouse can now be, now be built from Parker's Services. Oh, I can't wait. Okay, let's get the kiln. It's going to be messy in here probably for a while, you guys. I'm sorry. 200. We've got the ingots and the uh, clay. We're just going to plop it right down in the middle. That's the one thing with this game. I wish these, like our basement and our tool shed were just a little bit bigger. Okay, we need fine sand. Each sand won't do, so you must seek out sandstone in the mine. Okay, yeah, I haven't been getting much of that. I want to do the fishing part first. Okay, it looks like everything's being watered. No. No. Come on, just... There you go. No, I'm trying to get the oranges. There we go. Tight fit. Yeah. 
Lovely. Let's get this weed. Yeah, let's try and get some salmon and shrimp. And I'm prob I'm sure there's probably some new seasonal type fish as well. There are babies just out running around. <laughs> or at least our chickens were. Oh, I'll go baby girl touches. Is Thomas back at home yet? I can't remember if he sells things. I know he sells some stuff. But not right now. All right. We've bought something from him before, but I don't think it was seeds. Oh, let's go this way. I don't even remember what bait we need. We'll just try to get lucky. Maybe that one will be some shrimp. Oh. Not you. Oh. Not you. You. Oh, a clam. My goodness. Hold on. You guys, you might lose sound for a second. I'm sorry. I have to fiddle with something on my uh, OBS. Okay, there we go. I couldn't see the whole um, screen for OBS, so I couldn't tell how long we'd been recording. We're, we're good on time. Let's try and get the salmon. Or at least the shrimp. At least the shrimp, if not the salmon. Oh, quick! So we can give our gift. Oh, oh we need to yeah. also go water our plants. We'll do that, squid, over by the coven. We might not get the fishies today. We'll try. Oops, I was going to talk to Bruno. <laughs> oh. I'm going for the lobster looking crustacean, hoping that that could be a shrimp. Oh, yes. We also need to go over to the little hollow area. I forget what it's called. Oh, what do you have for us, Bruno? Hey, Bruno. Let's see what flower Trying seeds to catch are there. anything in particular today? How'd you know? I'm angling for a few flounder. Fried flounder makes the best fish sandwich. Mm -hmm. It was my Helena's favorite lunch. Aw. Delicious. Mm, that sounds so good. Let me know if you have extra. I will. I will, though. I'm not the best at cooking the thing. When I'm Aww. feeling a bit lonesome, I rustle up my own fish to make this sandwich. Reminds me of when Otto was a boy and Helena was still here. And life was just the three of us. So you're Fairhaven born and raised? Raised, yes, but I was born in Dresden. My dad fled Germany when I was real little. Do you remember Germany? Uh, all I remember is my dad telling me what his life used to be like before the bombing. That was what took my ma. I always thought Fairhaven was my only home. But now that Otto's all I have, and he hardly has time for me, maybe nowhere is my home these days. Fairhaven is still your home, Bruno. <laughs> even if Otto is distracted. I haven't been here long, but even I know your fishing shack is an island institution. Well, I am real proud of that. Thanks for the kind words, Tara. I sure am glad you're here. I want to make him a fish sandwich. Hey, Kim. Any luck today? Uh, not yet. I come out just to relax, really. I tried to drag my ex out on fishing charters when I lived in the city, but she got terribly seasick the first time and refused to come out on the water again. <laughs> oh, no, we're not going to say vomit makes good chum. The fairy would have been a problem. Maybe fish guts are gross. That's no, I guess vomit makes good chum. Hey, vomit makes good chum. That is disgusting. <laughs> it is disgusting. And also very true. It's not every day I run into a girl who knows what chum is. I'm impressed. Things are fine with my ex. We're still friends. She got custody of the cat, Aww. but I still visit him whenever I'm back in town. No way. You gave up the cat? Eh, I was allergic anyway. 
There's a stray around here. I feed it fish scraps and pet it sometimes, and I wash my hands like I'm scrubbing into surgery. Oh, that's sweet. Kitty companionship, none of the constant sneezing. It's a win-win. Well, thanks for keeping me company out here. It's nice to have a new friend who's not completely turned off by fish hooks and cut bait. Maybe <clears throat> next time you can tell me your tales of romantic woe. All right, we're now casual friends. Let's try a cricket. I mean, shrimp are little, so maybe they like a little, a small bait. Oh. Oh, quick. Ooh. A muscle. Oh, quick! Oh, I almost hit it too. Although I do need a salmon. Oh, so. A lobster. That looks little. Although I can't remember if the shrimp look like little fish. Or if they look more like the lobsters. I really can't remember. I think of shrimp as like a shellfish. So that's why I'm trying the crustaceans. the ink for some black dye for black leather so that's fine mm, I want the larger one for a possible salmon I may have to, after I'm done recording this, if we don't get them, double check. Back roll, uh, what we need. I might even just do that. Let's, uh, is it Mirkwood? I always forget the name of the, uh, the little place we take our boat to. I can never remember it. Pretty. Starter, that's new. I just realized salmon in real life is more of a river fish, so I probably wouldn't be getting that in the ocean. Yeah, whiskey. We could probably... No, we, we don't have the gold. Oh, freeze time for family time for Lena. I can do that. We have four of those. Nice. I know I'm here very late in the day, but we can at least say hello. Oh. I hope you're here because you're preparing an offering for the wellspring. I the usually coven am. cannot allow a wraith to escape from the gloaming again. We didn't. I mean, maybe we did. We still don't know why the Wellspring isn't balanced. Ravenwood Hollow cannot be at Ravenwood. the mercy of your incompetence. Once your coven had a member who gave me fennel, so that I might cast a charm to block wraiths from entering our village. But now all I have left is a small packet of fennel seeds. It won't make enough fennel seed powder for my charm. Perhaps you could grow some fennel in your garden and grind me some more fennel seed powder. I can it do that. is the least you could do. I've... Yes, ma'am. All right. So she has asked for fennel power. We've already got one, and we have fennel, so we'll be able to do that. So wait, wasn't the name of that witch trying that broke into 
the coven or broke through the vines to the coven. Wasn't she named Raven? And this is Ravenwood Hollow. Wesley told me Who's about Raven? that woman who cooks delicious food. Sophia, why would your auto say she's a witch? The scent of magic on a human is simple enough to sniff out. Humans don't have a nose like yours, Ariel. This would all be easier if we could just smell magic. Interesting. I think the name was Raven. That's how bad my memory is. <laughs> Wesley, wait up. Hello. I saw the Bramble Gate. I don't understand. Does the Coven have enemies? Clearly, but we don't know who. That's troubling. It... Oh, oh no. Wesley? It's nothing. Wesley, tell me what you know. So is your town starting preparations for the Winter Feast? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's my favorite. But Zephyr, you're not allowed to go to the Winter Feast. Are you? No, no one's ever seen me pop by. I just can't resist festive baked treats. Oh, cute. We should bring Zephyr something, some baked goodies. Oh, and Wesley just turned into a werewolf. All right, I think we are going to wrap up this episode here, you guys. Let's get in our house. I mean, it's still kind of early. But we're at a good stopping point. So we'll just continue this on the very next episode. Thanks so much for watching. Take care, everyone.